The SS Edmund Fitzgerald embarked on its last journey on November 9, 1975. The Fitzgerald set out from the docks at Burlington Northern Railroad in Wisconsin at the leftmost edge of Lake Superior and was joined on its journey to Detroit by another ship, the Arthur M. Anderson. When the ships headed out, their crews knew that a storm was approaching. Less than an hour into the journey, the Fitzgerald reported having taken damage, presumably from waves. They wanted to get to Wisconsin's Whitefish Point across the lake as fast as possible and continued on. At about 7 p.m., two massive waves hit the Anderson and headed toward the direction of the Fitzgerald. The ships lost radio contact, and the Fitzgerald vanished. A three-day search began on November 14th, which eventually led to the discovery of the Fitzgerald's underwater wreckage a mere 17 miles away from Whitefish Point. 